सिद्धार्थ सिद्धार्थ इज आस्किंग दैट सर यू सेड दैट वी आर वंडरफुल ब्यूटिफुल एज वी आर डज दैट मीन दैट वी शुड बी सेल्फ कंटेंट एंड नॉट ट्राई टू डेवलप यस इज दैट द क्वेश्चन सिद्धार्थ I may have everything with me. I may have everything very, very close to me, right there within me. But would or it be of any use to me if I do not remember that I have it with me? I may have everything, but if I do not remember that I have it. Will it be of any use to me? I may have a thousand rupee note tucked in my pocket, but I do not remember that I have it. I do not remember that I already have it. Then what will I do? What will I do? I'll go around begging for money. I'll move around with the thought that I am poor, right? Just having a thousand rupee note with me will not give me any richness. Now it's a very strange situation. I am rich and yet I am poor. I am rich and yet I am. That is our situation. That is Siddharth situation. That is everybody's situation. We are rich, and yet we are poor. We are very, very rich. There is nobody more rich than us. No richer person ever existed. You are the richest man that ever was, and yet there is hardly anybody who is poorer than us. Isn't that strange? Isn't that funny? Isn't that tragic? Isn't that tragic? That in spite of being so rich, I'm still so poor. You said that, sir, if we have everything, then can we be self-content? Just having is not sufficient. One must also know that I have it. I must also know that I have it. So no, we'll make all efforts to know that we have it. When Dilpreet asked me that question, you remember I forgot that I have the mic. And what did I do when I forget forgot that I have the mic? What did I do? I started looking around. And then I said I am a fool if I am looking around. I should have rather looked I should have rather looked at myself. That is the key. That is the way ahead. If you want to look for your riches if you want to look at what you already have do not look around look at look at siddharth look at yourself looking here and there will not tell me where the mic has gone to find out what i already have i'll have to look at myself now how do i look at myself i'll have to look at myself by looking at my daily life because that's what i am so we asked about life we said life is this 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 every moment that is passing so if we want to look at ourselves if we want to really know how we are what we are then we'll have to look at our daily life you may keep on thinking that you are very brave but look at your daily life is your regular day not full of fear 
if attendance requirement is removed how many of you would yet keep coming to the college so is it not because of fear that you come to the college if the fear of examinations is not there how many of you would yet study if the fear of unemployment is not there how many of you would yet want to become an engineer look at your daily life if you want to know yourself look at your daily life initially you will see only the dirt that is there but once the dirt is removed once the dirt is taken care of then you will discover the precious richness that you have initially when you will look at yourself you will only see dirt you will only see that you are confused and afraid and distracted and violent and miserable initially when you honestly look at yourself you will only find this but don't be afraid don't stop looking at yourself don't think that there is no fun looking at myself because whenever i look at myself i only see an ugly man that man is not ugly but just that too much dirt has gathered on his face once you remove the dirt he or she is beautiful very very beautiful but there is too much of dirt that is there that dirt has come to you from outside from what you have heard what you have read what society has given you what cinema and tv and literature and religion and family and society views opinions concepts the dirt is coming from there so when you look at yourself you will find that dirt only when you will find that dirt then you can only when i see the dirt then i can when i see the dirt then i can wonderful when you see the dirt then you can remove the dirt and when you remove the dirt you will find oh my god i already have such a beautiful nice jewel with me a diamond and i was looking here and there trying to improve myself there is no need to improve i already have it there is no need to become something i already have it you cannot be self content siddharth till you do not remove that dirt so i am saying to you do not be self content till that dirt is removed but removal of dirt is one thing and trying to borrow a diamond from somewhere is another thing do you see this that these are two opposite things i have the diamond and i remove the dirt that has gathered over it that is one thing but to think that i don't have it and trying to get it from somebody else somewhere else is another thing most of us are busy trying to import a diamond trying to get it from somebody else no there is no need you already have it just cleans it yes so do not be self content i am not saying that do be dissatisfied do be dissatisfied but that dissatisfaction should not leave you should not lead you to the outside that dissatisfaction should lead you to the lovely that dissatisfaction should lead you to the inside because that's where you will find that which will really satisfy you inside is where you will find that which will really satisfy you if you keep going outwards you will not find anything you will keep going and going and you see people all around they are all going outside trying to find this and that and it's an endless movement which gives you nothing how can it give you anything whatever is to be given is already there so how can anything be given have i made myself clear hmm? yes yes i'll come to you next yes right good what's your name kanika sit 
I'll take this and then I'll come to you. Related to this? Yeah. So, we have a question. At this point of this, how will you describe the term success to us? Success. Right. Good. What's your name? Sarfaraz. Sarfaraz. Sit. So, Kanika and Sarfaraz both have raised a question related to success. What is success? What do we mean by a successful person? Hmm? Let's try to understand. First thing, when I say that I want success, what am I saying? When I say I want success, we are looking at the statement carefully, closely. I want success. Hmm? What am I saying? If I want success, then surely I do not. Am I right? Am I right? If I want success, then surely I am not successful right now. Remember, all success that you want is a success of future. All success that you want is a success of future. When you say that I want success, what you mean is that at some point in the time ahead, I will get something which will make me feel successful. Am I right? That is how you think that at some point in future, I will get something which will make me feel successful. By wanting success, you have already declared yourself to be a failure right now. Have you not? You are saying that this is where I am. Sir Faraz, this is where I am and I am unsuccessful. This is where I want to be in the future. And if I get here, then I will be successful. We do not know what this point is, where does it lie and whether you will get here. All that is uncertain. But what is certain is that you have labelled yourself to be a failure right now. How many of you want to declare that right now I am a failure? How many of you are interested in doing that? That right now I am a nobody, an unworthy being, a failure. How many of you want to say that? But then, how many of you want success? All of you want success without understanding what wanting success means. To want success is to say that I am a failure. I will be successful and I am a I am a failure. I am a failure, I want to be successful. I am a failure, I want to be successful. Now, is that a pleasant state of mind to live in? Is that a pleasant state of mind? I am a failure. I want success. And the more hungry and thirsty for success you are, the bigger a failure you have declared yourself in the present. Now, when are you living? In the future or in the present? When are you living? In the present. How can you live? How can you live joyfully after declaring yourself to be a failure in the present? And that is the reason why we are so bored, why our faces are often so long, why we keep feeling frustrated and tense, Because all of us have labelled ourselves to be a failure. 
and it doesn't feel good right it doesn't feel good how will you feel writing down 10 times in your copy i am a failure i am a failure i am a laggard i am unsuccessful how will you feel writing this down 10 times yes you will feel bad how many of you will feel bad but do you feel bad writing down i want success you don't feel bad writing down i want success because you do not understand what you are saying because you do not look carefully at it you have the power to understand remember you have the diamond you have the power to understand but you do not use that power and is the power of any use if i do not apply it is the medicine of any use if i do not eat it are my eyes of any use if i do not open them are my eyes of any use if i do not open them if my is my mind of any use if i do not use it how many of us really use the mind we don't so the diamond is there but we have forgotten that it is to be used we are just running after success without understanding what this race means With, without understanding what this race means you are good already good the present moment itself changes into the future time is like a river continuously flowing in the present moment if you are good if you are fine if you are attentive then the future will take care of itself most of us are very afraid of the future afraid of examinations afraid of unemployment afraid of what we call as the challenges of life huh and everybody is telling you life is a great challenge come to us we'll prepare you to face that challenge huh and so you are afraid deep within a fear has taken roots that life is bad i must fight life <coughs> i must be successful life is not bad life can become very bad if we live like an idiot then life can become very bad otherwise life is beautiful very very beautiful you have not come here to suffer life is beautiful life is enjoyable but only if you live to your potential all of us have great potential life will become a suffering if we do not live to that potential and living to that potential is very easy it's not difficult do not think that any great effort is needed little simple attention some understanding opening of the eyes looking at our daily lives only that much is needed and everything will be all right leave the future forget the future forget success success will come by itself the future will take care of itself you be successful right now forget the success of future what does it mean to be successful right now what does it mean to be successful right now to be successful right now means to be in love with life it means i am joyful i am celebrating i do not require two or four festivals in the entire year every day is a festival for me life is a big party for me and i am successful right now you know what the thing about life is if you feel rich life gives you more and more 
इफ यू फील पुअर लाइफ गिव्स यू नथिंग द लाइफ डज नॉट नो एनी पिटी दोज हु आर ऑलरेडी रिच दोज हु आर ऑलरेडी सेलिब्रेटिंग लाइफ गिव्स दैम मोर एंड मोर रीजन्स टू सेलिब्रेट एंड दोज हु आर हंग्री एंड थर्स्टी लाइफ कीप्स दैम मोर एंड मोर हंग्री एंड थर्स्टी हंग्री एंड थर्स्टी फॉर वॉट फॉर वॉट सक्सेस लाइफ सेज यू वॉन्ट टू रन आफ्टर सक्सेस नो कीप रनिंग कीप रनिंग योर एंटायर लाइफ Keep running, and those who say I am already successful, life gives him more and more joy, more and more reasons to celebrate, more and more enjoyment. Every day is holy, every night is Diwali. Otherwise, I am waiting for Diwali to come. Then I will be successful. Let Diwali come. I am preparing for Diwali. Don't prepare. The moment is right now. The party is right now. Today is the festival. Don't wait for New Year to come. we will celebrate only on new year's eve how can i say i love you today valentines day is still so many months away don't wait we keep waiting for success for everything this is the moment when you are alive if you are listening listen fully this listening fully itself is celebration those who are listening deeply they know what i am saying you listen fully and there is a feeling of completeness there is a feeling of celebration when will you will go out after this session in some time half an hour then look at the skies and when you look at the sky look fully don't just look at it oh another day another type of sky it's been raining since two months what's new today there is something new today you are alive today that's what is new every moment is new understanding living every moment is the celebration of life do not miss it hmm? have you ever looked closely at the trees in your campus ever seriously or have you just said oh there are so many trees everywhere there are few more trees in the campus i ask you do you really look closely even at the face of your parents or do you just say oh same mama same papa same home what is there to look at do you really look at them do you really look at their face do you really look into their eyes do you do you find time to really really talk to them connect to them deeply intimately or is it just a routine sort of living mama prepare breakfast for me papa give me some money and some general casual gossip chit chat and that's all do you really find time to have a heart to heart conversation that's what partying is all about that's what celebration is all about do not wait for a particular day that particular day i'll talk to my mother which particular day when i'll get the degree then i'll go and show her today ma i am successful and then i'll tell my younger brother mere paas ma hai ma aaj bhi hai tumhare paas but you are waiting for the day when you will be successful i'll become a good son of my father only on the day when i get a good job when i get a good job then i'll be successful no don't wait today you sat in this session now go and tell them today 
was a great day i enjoyed why wait for the day of placement that that day i'll go and talk to parents hmm today itself is a great day and tomorrow is a great day and day after tomorrow will be a great day every day is a great day provided you live it if you don't live it then every day is a dead day so who is a successful person kanika ha huh? everybody has the potential to be successful right now but you are right now successful only if you are fully alive right now fully awake right now fully attentive right now not if you are sleeping not if you are gossiping not if you are distracted then you are missing the party hmm yes do not live at the surface go deep into it do you really know your friends well seriously there would be so many of us who would not be fully acquainted if fully is too big a word to use deeply acquainted with their friends even with their best friends you may hang around with your friend have fun with him joke around but do you really know your friend really do you really know yourself to know anybody else you have to first know first know in the coming months you will do an activity called who am i watch out exciting who am i yeah don't wait for that again you are looking towards the future who am i is simple enough look at your daily life how you enter the college how you sit in the sessions how you take your meals what do you do in the evening how do you spend your nights how busy are you on the phone what do you really talk about on the phone how you harass your boyfriends and girlfriends ha huh? how you are jealous and insecure often not always how you waste your time how you miss out on opportunities how you don't dance when it's time to dance how many of you dance fully freely good how many and what about the rest sir we watch naachna gana acche logo ka kaam thode hi hai inko naachne do hum dekhte hain can't dance can't dance and you ask me how can i be successful you cannot dance and you are going after success seriously you can't dance when you come to do your role plays see how inhibited you are and you are asking for success this moment is so rotten and you are asking for success in the future take care of this moment take care of this moment the rottenness of this moment will not go away by dreaming of the future if i am sick right now when should i take the medicine right now or in the future do it right now dance today enjoy today learn today read today hmm do not dream about the future dreams are a good escape dreams mean i will not do it today it will happen sometime later do not dream live we are talking of opening your eyes dreams means you know your eyes are closed don't dream live but that's scary ha huh? 
some of you are already afraid what is this man talking living that's the most dangerous thing we can be hurt 